we always looked at uh, the next match and, and no further than the next match. And um, we're fortunate at the moment we've got a, a special group of players who've been there before. Um, you know, relatively young, but they've got uh, a wealth of experience under their belts. So, you know, they know what works uh, and how to win these type of matches. They've been there before. So, um, you know, from us as coaches, really, it's it's over to them. They know what's awaiting them tomorrow. We know it's going to be a very, we know it's going to be a very tough game for us. Ireland, obviously, a very good side. Um, but again, like Robin said, you know, the boys have been there and done it. Um, they won most of their, most of their away games in the last two years of Six Nations. So, um, you know, it's just another challenge again for us tomorrow. And yeah, there's a calmness, but there's an edge about us as well. And uh, when are we looking forward to tomorrow? It's, you know, obviously, you've got five games. So it's important and well, imperative you try and win your home games. Um, we've got to try and do that. You know, we're going to go France and Scotland home as well. Um, but you know, if you're going to win the title, you've got to take something on the road. And um, you know, it's our first away game tomorrow. And uh, as I said, we're under no illusions at the size of the task. But you know, if we play well, it's a game that we feel we can do well in. And um, you know, we've got to back ourselves. And we know it's going to be tough. But um, you know, we've done it before. Obviously, we'll wait and see tomorrow. Well, you know, we've we obviously been told that uh, supposedly there's a, a lot of rain coming, um, probably windy conditions. So, yeah, it doesn't suit the ball in hand game, does it? But, you know, certainly there will be a lot of kicking, but it's got to be accurate kicking and the right type of kicking as well, doesn't it? But um, look, we, we'll get to that point when, uh, when tomorrow comes. Um, like I said, our main focus is on ourselves and whatever we bring to the party tomorrow, and uh, we just got to be on edge and be ready to rock. So we know that Ireland score um, pretty much the majority of their points in the first half. So um, we've got to start well, you know. Um, you know, Scotland managed to keep hold of the ball early on, but they didn't really um, capitalise on, on all our possession. So you know, we've got to make sure that we, we're on the money tomorrow. And uh, if any opportunities come our way, we've got to be clinical. Um, you know, we know that uh, Ireland have been preparing for us. Um, they said uh, last season, you know, that was the most the best prepared they've been. So they've obviously uh, done the homework and. Um, you know, we, we've got to be aware of that early on. Um, so I dare say there will be tries. Uh, as long as we score more tries than them, we'll be really, really happy. Uh, obviously, Joe's only just come in. He's an outstanding coach. done a fantastic job with Leinster. Um, so, yeah, I'm sure they're going to have certain things up their sleeve tomorrow and a lot of plays that uh, we might not have seen so far. But, again, we've got to adapt to that. And, uh, you know, whatever the circumstances are in terms of conditions or whatever they bring, we've got to be ready and uh, we've got to be on the ball for it tomorrow. It is always tough after a six-day turnaround. Uh, however, you know I think they've been smart. I think they've uh, they've been able to manage their squad accordingly. Um, so uh, I, d I don't think it'll it'll, uh, it'll be that much uh, make difference tomorrow. Um, you know we know we uh, finished strongly the last twenty minutes of games. That's when we you know we really um, benefit from all the physical uh, training that we're doing, and um, you know. If we got a nose ahead with 20 minutes to go, I think we'd be pretty confident. Last year, that you know, he just blitzed us for sort of a 20-minute period in our first half and at the start of the second, um, 30 points to three down. We felt, you know, 23-3. Even then, you know, it was 20 points. We still could come back in the game. And as Robin said, you know, we back ourselves with about 20 to go. And I think spoke to most of the boys that we know, you know, been involved with the Lions, and they said they were hanging on a little bit towards the end. But problem was, we were 30 points down. Um, and obviously the game before, you know, we scored some uh, fantastic tries ourselves, and, and, and obviously with Lee's kick at the end to, to snatch victory. Um, so um, yeah, it's been a lot of good battles between us. I think certainly for the last four or five years, and been pretty tight, pretty close. Could have gone either way. Um, so as I said, I don't think tomorrow will be any different. I think it'll be a tight physical game. Um, you know, and it's, it's about who takes the chances at the right, you know, when they come around.